Good morning and welcome to another What We Eat In A Day video. Today is a Saturday. Um, I am the first one up. I make coffee, step number one for any day. Um, but I really savor and enjoy it on a Saturday. Sorry, I just realized what's going on with my hair. Okay, um, so this is my hair like naturally curly. I know this is obviously a what we eat in a day video, but um, this is what it looks like uh, natural. And I've just been a little lazy lately, so I've been wearing it like this a little bit more, trying to get used to it. It used to be really, really curly, and then it stopped for a little bit. And now it's getting really, really curly again, so this is kind of in between. Anyways, I digress. Today on the itinerary, I think we're going to go to Trader Joe's to pick up some groceries. Um, apart from that, I don't think we have a ton planned, so we'll just kind of see how the day takes us and what yummy treats we um find along the way all right now i'm gonna have my coffee and we're gonna get ready because we have to film another video and then we're off to trader joe's i already said that oh um i do have a question for you for who you oh me mm -hmm. for who i didn't know i don't know um may i borrow a little granola I have some yogurt to eat for breakfast, but I just there's not, not much left. left. There was only enough left for me to have one more. Otherwise, I don't have anything to eat for breakfast. That's Are sex. you going to make me starve? Yeah. Where are you hiding? Is that a no? <laughs> Is that a no? We'll see. Well, I'm going to eat breakfast right now, so... Let me see how much I have left. Okay. Success. She's letting me eat it. So, I don't know what this is. The brand is baked vegan almond granola. I'm going to put it in my yogurt for breakfast. Oh, my hair. All right. So, you can probably guess what I'm having for breakfast. I'm having avocado toast. I got my avocado. I have my favorite gluten-free bread. Um, I'm gonna top it with the, everything with the bagel seasoning, which I just have enough for this. So I'm gonna buy like three bottles of Trader Joe's today because literally put it on everything. Um, and then I'm gonna have one of these fruit and nut thingies also from Trader Joe's. It's apricot almond. Um, I feel like I need something else. I don't know, I don't really have. We will have a couple of these. Um, I got these from Whole Foods a little while ago. They have these coffee cacao organic power snacks. Cacao coffee dates contains eight superfoods. They're really good. I like them, but they were really expensive. So I don't know if I'd buy them again. But yeah, maybe I'll have a couple of those. Yeah, I think, I think that's gonna be my breakfast. I really want an acai bowl, but we don't have time because we've got to get filming and then get to Trader Joe's. Look at Poppy Monroe. What is happening right now? <laughs> this is her favorite spot on the couch. Oh my lord. Hi Angel Bear, you sleepies? Oh my goodness, ridiculous. All right, so this is breakfast. It doesn't look very appetizing because this stuff looks weird, but got my avocado toast. I added some nutritional yeast because I didn't have a ton of the everything but the bagel seasoning. These are those coffee cacao little bites. This is my almond apricot thing. And then I have my daily turmeric shot. So I'm gonna enjoy this and then we're gonna film and then we're off to Trader Joe's. Hey guys, so popping in. This is actually the day before we're filming this video, but I went to Whole Foods today. Um, and then you obviously saw we went to Trader Joe's, but I picked up a few things from Whole Foods and I know a lot of you guys really like our like grocery hauls, like what we bought. So I thought I would show you really quick since we're gonna film this full video tomorrow that you're watching. Um, I thought I would show you what I picked up from Whole Foods. All right, so I just got a couple things, but it was freaking expensive, but that's what you get when you go to Whole Foods. Um, but I got two things of rice cauliflower. I use this all the time. Um, I got this quinoa, and what I like about this one is that you like heat it up in the microwave, like in this bag, and it takes like two minutes, and that's all it takes to cook it, so it's really nice. 
This is my all-time favorite gluten-free bread. I have not seen it at any other Whole Foods. I've only seen it in New York because it is a New York brand. I'm hoping that they expand to other places because I can never find it in Texas when we're there. But it is my all-time favorite. I got these um, almond flour tortillas because I have some jackfruit, so I'm gonna make some um, tacos. I got some mixed berries for my acai bowls, raspberries, um, protein powder. I wanted to try this flavor because this one actually has less sugar than the chocolate peanut butter or just the regular peanut butter. So I want to try this one and see if I like it. Um, I got this sweet and salty microwave popcorn, no salt grain free tortilla chips, spinach. Oh, I found this sparkling water, lime mint elderflower, and that is all things that I love. So I'm hoping that tastes really good. This is my new favorite coffee creamer that I really like. It's a plant-based, um, dairy-free creamer. I got jalapeno and dairy-free cream cheese. Two things of this lemon hummus because it's so good. Um, some cilantro for a recipe that I'm making. Some spicy black beans. Um, my turmeric shots that I take pretty much every day. So I love them. One avocado for my breakfast tomorrow. I'm going to pick up more at Trader Joe's, which you already saw. Um, these peanut butter perfect bars are amazing. I grabbed two of them. Then I picked up these because they're so good. I was really good for about a week and didn't have a lot of sweets, but now I'm back to this, but it's honestly, it's not that bad. And if I, there's two in here, so if I just have like one at a time, I think it'll be good. And then Ashley had bought these and she let me try them and they were really good and they were on sale. So that is my Whole Foods haul. Headed to Trader Joe's now. Gonna pick up not a ton of stuff, but we each have a few Trader Joe's specific things we want to grab real quick. So that's the next stop on our agenda on this Saturday. now and this week I've been really into making like fun waters so that I drink more water so this is just a sparkling water that I picked up at the grocery store but I put fruit in it so oranges limes lemons and some uh, mint so what I've been doing here I'll show you I've pre pre sliced fruit and I'm just keeping it in this container in the fridge so it's ready to go so like every day in the afternoon I've been doing this little concoction and then I just refill the water as I drink it and it's a great way to get me to drink more water because I get excited about it. Just like the water, I've been having some cut up veggies in the fridge too that I can just go to um, quickly and easily for a snack. There's some ranch and then this is some uh, chili powder and if you guys remember in our Mexico vlog this was my go-to snack every day for lunch so I've been carrying that over along with I just made some quesadillas these are just um, Kosova flour tortillas from that brand Siete they also make really good chips it is vegan cheese that is shredded and some black beans so that is my lunch quesadillas crudite and fun water party water I'm gonna call it so I failed and forgot to film when I was eating, but I had some of these everything bite-sized crackers from TJ's and some of these cheese slices. The healthiest lunch you ever did see. <laughs> I shouldn't have, but I just wanted like a snack. I wasn't super, super hungry. Ashley's still having her quesadilla. I need to put the rest of my groceries away. We didn't do like a little haul. Everything was melty, so we... We filmed the... I did film my Whole Foods haul. Um, yeah, everything was melting so we had to put it away, but after she's done eating, we're gonna go get some coffee because I'm falling asleep. Off to grab coffee now. Where'd you say you wanna go? Birch. Birch. Birch coffee is where we're headed. We're trying out a new coffee place tomorrow, but they will post about it on stories, but um, it was, Alex is fine and she wants to come with us, so. Sorry she can't come right now, so. 
She can. I'm calling her out. She, she can. She doesn't want to. She's choosing not to come right now. <laughs> so. Now she's got mini space buns. Yeah. As much as they can be. <laughs> because, because she doesn't have much hair. Because, um, it's so hot. But tomorrow, I think it's finally going to start to cool off. Yay! Goodness. Because I am ready. And did you hear pumpkin spice lattes are coming back like August 28th? It's like the earliest. I think it's raining. It's like the earliest they've ever come back, I think. I don't really like pumpkin spice latte that much. I don't really either, to be completely honest. I mean, they're good, and like I always have one, like right at the beginning. Yeah. But then. Not a PSL. Alright, my arm's tired. Gotta go. Bye! <laughs> Alright, it is now dinner time and I am starving. So I'm going to make this butternut squash ravioli from TJ's because it's one of my favorite things that they do this time of year. Um, and then I'm just going to throw that on top of some of these sweet potato ribbons, some shaved Brussels sprouts, and some arugula. Super quick, simple dinner. Alright, dinner's done. I just put some um, shredded Parmesan cheese on top. I'm excited to eat this. Hello, Ashley Christine. <laughs> Alright, so Ashley hasn't even had dinner yet, and I'm already moving on to dessert. So I'm going to have some of these dark chocolate covered strawberries from TJ's because they are literally the greatest thing in the world. I can go through a whole box in one sitting, but I'm not going to. Um, and then Alex and I just made some tea, and I'm having this butter mint one, and it's one of my absolute favorites. It's so tasty. It tastes exactly like those little like powdery like butter mints that they have like at weddings sometimes in some restaurants, and they just like melt in your mouth. It's my favorite thing. So that's what it tastes like. Ash, are you gonna eat dinner anytime soon? It's not even 7:30. <laughs> I was hungry today. <laughs> what are you doing? I was trying to fix my hair because there's it's, no fixing it. There, there is no fixing it. So um, I've been staring at the camera before I hit record, trying to fix it, like using the camera as a mirror, but it's just not happening. Anyways, I am going to make my dinner now. This is what I'm gonna have. I'm gonna make this salad kit that I got at Whole Foods. It's like a chopped salad. Um, with a like Asian sesame dressing and then I made some of this pasta earlier in the week it is that um, I think the brand's Banza the chickpea pasta that I always use um, because there's some protein in the pasta um, and then I have some black beans somewhere that I'm gonna add in here too Shelby's painting her nails mm -hmm. and that's gonna be my dinner I don't know if I'll have dessert. We'll see. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I am gonna have dessert, guys. Oh, really? What are you gonna have? Um, I think I'm gonna have. Where'd you put um these? Other powders. I got some of these at Trader Joe's. I'm short. <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna have a few of these for my dessert. I just almost fell over. But Ashley's gonna end the video for you. Before the battery dies. Bye. Bye. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching our latest What We Eat In A Day video. If you wanna see more videos like this from us, nope, not doing that with my hair. <laughs> want to see more videos like this from us please give us a thumbs up subscribe so you never miss a video right there and watch our latest video right here we will see you guys next time bye